What what do you call this? A notebook. A duotank. tank. What? A what? A what? Canadian English is filled with words that are uniquely ours, like toque or double double or even washroom. Every place, every region, every country has its own words that we use that no one else uses. For decades, the Canadian Oxford Dictionary was the definitive reference manual, thanks to founding editor Catherine Barber. And if you buy a case of these, you have that uniquely Canadian word, a 2-4. But the last time it was updated was 2004. But the Canadian staff laid off soon after. The work of finding new words is now the job of Oxford English Dictionary staff in the UK and US. I definitely think it um, puts Canadian English at a uh, disadvantage, or at the very least, it, it doesn't give it the same kind of visibility and representation as you see for other varieties. But as a Canada research chair, Sally Taglamonte has taken it upon herself to submit new words for consideration to Oxford. My job is to, to get more Canadian words into that dictionary so that instead of having like just over 200 words that are designated as Canadian or even Ontario, that there will be more words. That's why if you look up the phrase bush party in the online Oxford dictionary, you'll see a Canadian citation. A pleasant surprise for the linguist who submitted it. I can't believe it. It's the first time I've actually uh, verified whether they used my words. While some publishers and editors' organizations are discussing creating a new Canadian dictionary, Teglamonte wants more Canadians to appreciate their distinct differences. From the way we order coffee to where we play as children, these are words that color our existence and lead us to have connections between people. Words hopefully captured in a new dictionary to call our own. Eli Glasner, CBC News, Toronto.